How has shale gas changed the energy portfolio in the U.S., and how does that impact energy security? We've seen significant changes in the uh, volumes of fuels now, energy, we'll say, in a broader sort of way that are coming out of Pennsylvania with the advent of shale uh, energy development and also other types of energy. And there's a real relationship uh, between the two. So as we see more shale development, as it's going forward and large volumes of gas that are being uh, produced in Pennsylvania, it's offsetting the need uh, for other types of fuel sources or other types of energy production that might have been there in the past, namely coal. Uh, but we're also then seeing the implications to other industries like nuclear, potentially renewables, and others, uh, you know, even the potential to develop other industries, energy-related industries over time. So there's a significant impact coming from uh, energy development as it's occurring with shale, shale uh, oil and gas, uh, gas when you think about Pennsylvania, but oil when you think about other aspects of the U.S. Uh, more broadly or globally. Uh, one of the places that we certainly see major implications is in the uh, power generation side. So we see uh, less nuclear potentially, uh, which could be problematic when we think about carbon, uh, but we also uh, are seeing a greater pairing of renewables. And so as we see more renewables come forward, uh, there's demand then uh, to be able to uh, backfill when renewables aren't producing. So that's a place that often is, is considered for uh, natural gas and larger and larger amounts of our natural gas are coming from shale. So again, there's opportunities that we'll likely see going forward, but there's other issues related to that that we need to keep uh, in consideration uh, with these other types of fuels that we've been using over the course of time. Now the implications of that to the U.S., as just stated, also have um, impact uh, on a global nature. So as more uh, power, for instance, is being generated from uh, some of these gas uh, supplies, then that potentially is uh, less gas to be shipped, or that's power that we might be distributing in different uh, ways across border to Mexico and, and to Canada. So either power going across in wires or gas going across uh, back and forth in pipes.